definitely don't have under boob, Misha. Um, I mean, look at them. So no sweaty crotch. The best looking picnic blanket you've ever laid your eyes on. The dark horse. I said it. Get a little rag music. I don't know the word. Bop, bop. Roaming around the Eiffel Tower. Happy Super Hall Sunday! And it's back. It's finally Sunday again. Okay, growing up, I actually used to hate Sundays, but I feel like now because of Super Hall Sunday, I enjoy Sundays. Also, the fact that I don't have to go to school tomorrow. But anyway, hello everyone, and welcome back to more shopping hauls. Yes, whoops. But today's video is actually going to be my fourth, yes that is four, Fashion Nova haul. Now, I've done, obviously I've done four other than that, three other Fashion Nova hauls, yeah, is that right? And this is the fourth one. And I feel like with each haul, my love grows for Fashion Nova. Honestly, honestly, I know that some people are a bit like, ooh, ah, all in from America, what you want to expect? Trust me, trust in me, that honestly you're going to be blown away by Fashion Nova. They have such incredible unique pieces and I picked up some right crackers for this haul. So yes, thank you Fashion Nova for sending over all these pieces but in no way does that affect what I have to say about them. Because if I may say so myself, one of my skills, ugh, eating my hair, that's not one of my skills, one of my skills is not eating my hair, but one of my skills is actually online shopping, and I know that sounds ridiculous, but literally, speak to anyone that I know, like Scarlett, Mum, Anya, they'll all say, that's all the people that I know, my mum, my sister, my best friend, wow, Chloe, you'll also agree, won't you Chloe? Chloe's my other best friend. But anyway, yes, that I just seem to have a secret skill for online shopping. I don't know what it is, but you can give me any website and I just seem to be able to find some pretty darn good pieces. So yes, I think as long as you are careful with what you select, you make sure you really love it, then it is absolutely worth ordering from Fashion Nova. There is no import fees. I've never had a single import fee and it literally takes like a week to come. Now, from America, that is darn good. And yes, okay, let's get a wiggle on. I do have a code, it's XO, no wait, X O Misha G sounds like Gossip Girl or something and that gets you 20% off the whole Fashion Nova site so yes don't forget to use my code if you want to order any of these goodies I will of course link absolutely everything down below the dungarees I'm wearing are from my previous Fashion Nova haul and I love them but let's get a wig on because I've been blabbering on for like two minutes now and you guys don't care you just want to see the goodies well the first thing I'm actually going to talk about the short that I wore in last week's Super Hall Sunday that everyone was obsessed with. Like there were so, so many comments and I'm not surprised, I will show you them now. Here we go. So can we see, they just kind of seem like your normal go-to denim shorts. But I kind of stole this idea of Lorna Lux. So whenever she like says about things on her Instagram, she always says about if she sizes up so that it fits a bit different. And then she said that she bought denim shorts in a size bigger so that she could like cinch in the waist. And actually, I really dig that. I wore them last time with a belt, but I also think they look quite nice, like low rise without a belt. And these are honestly just like dream shorts. I got them in a size small, which I think is probably like a, I don't know. I'd say like it's a, a big six, yeah, yeah. That's probably about right. But no, they are such nice denim, such good quality. They're not really stiff, so you don't feel like a little stuffed sausage. My favorite phrase, oh my gosh. This bit of hair keeps on finding its way in my mouth. Yeah, what do we think of this hairdo? Do I look like a yodeler who's about to go and like serve German beer? Who's from Switzerland? Is that, I don't really, that sounds about right. Or does it look cute? Let a gal know, I'm not really sure. I don't know if it makes my head look even fatter, which is quite an achievement, so well done hairstyle. But no, I love these shorts. I think they are sadly out of stock, but I will link other options because honestly if there's one thing that you need to buy from Fashion Nova it's their denim like everyone says that their denim is amazing and I totally agree here are the dream shorts now as we can see they are like the nicest fit because I could pull them down and they're not so tight or I could cinch them up and put a belt around them 
but they are honestly like they're not too bummy they are just like my ultimate pair of shorts and i really really want more of them like i need them in like a black denim a white denim and everything denim just look so they're like a nice loose fit but that's kind of how they work it gives that sort of like i'm so cool fit which i mean i'm obviously not but a girl can try Ta -da! okay so this piece honestly blows my mind because the quality is next level like it's one of those off the shoulder fluty sleeves fluty skirt dresses but the the fabric i don't even know what this fabric is but it's such good quality like you know when you can just feel that something feels expensive that doesn't make any sense oh it says this garment well fitting and made with high quality material i mean i agree completely it's in this really interesting i would say it's a lemon pattern but i don't actually think it is i think it's just yellow flowers and um, i mean just look how cute it is like doesn't this look so like dolce and gabbana-esque or just something very tropical. There's loads of those brands that have all these like really summery, off the shoulder dresses and these jazzy patterns. And I just cannot wait to wear this. Like honestly, can England sort itself out? Because I do think this is quite a thick material. So I don't know that I could maybe wear it in like anything above like 26 degrees. Just being very specific. Specific? Specific. Maybe like 26.4 degrees, you know, just making sure I get that zero point in there. Ta -da, ta -da. Okay, I'm realizing now that I'm wearing this, that it isn't the easiest to like move your arms loads with, but who cares when the dress is this cute? Let me just move you back. I want you people to see it in all its glorious glory. And excuse my fake tan, I need to have a scrub. Can we see the length? Can we see? It's not like too long, it's not too short. Just look how cute it is with a little belt. I just think this looks so expensive. And there's a really annoying fly in the room right now and I want to catch it because it's buzzing everywhere. But no, just look, I look like a little trifle. <laughs> Is there a trifle song? Because I feel like I always sing in these videos, but I don't think there's a trifle song. Let me know if there's a trifle song. But just look how luscious this looks. I won't turn around too much because the back of my hair probably looks appalling. But just this dress is just so, so beautiful. I love it. Now, actually, let's go to a piece that I'm very unsure of. Now, you're going to be thinking, Misha, what the hell have you just shown us? Okay. So, this is like a tulle, can you see, tulle skirt with little pearls on it. And like, in my head, this is so Pinterest and so adorable. Don't quite know how it's actually going to look. Might look like a blancmange, but it's basically like a maxi see-through tulle skirt. No clue what I'm going to wear with it underneath. I suppose this is a testing time for all of us. But yeah, I just thought it was really cute and it's so Pinterest. Like, imagine me in like Paris roaming around the Eiffel Tower. Yeah, you, you catch my drift? Okay, so yeah, this is gonna be an interesting one to try on. Let's all like hope that Misha can pull off whatever you call this little thing in Bobby. But it's really cute, so I hope so, I hope so. I've got a vision in my mind and I hope it hays off. Okay, Misha. The ballerina. Okay guys, I've actually turned into a ballerina. If only I could go on point, but sadly not. Okay guys, I actually love this. This is like the cutest thing I think I've ever tried on in my life. I feel like a little princess. <laughs> Can I just wear this all day, every day? I've literally just stuck it with like a white crop top and then I've got like a nude bodysuit underneath. I don't care. I'm dressed like a ballerina and I love it. It is so cute and just girly. I also think you could maybe put like a pair of little shorts underneath if you didn't want to be so nude. But no, this is, this is just my idea of heaven really. World's worst YouTuber, yes. So I was just packing up and I realised I forgot to show this jazzy swimsuit. What would a haul be without a piece of swimwear? Now this strap bit, I think you're actually supposed to wear it like that. So it's like a one shoulder, 
but I quite like it if I like have it up a little, I feel like it goes like jum 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 around the body, but no this is such a nice like swimsuit stroke bikini, I'm not even sure, here's a bit of my butt, you know, the huge, also I feel like it gives me a tiny bit of a cleavage maybe if i had like okay yeah definitely don't have under boob misha don't think so highly of yourself but no i think this is so jazzy i wore it the other day and that's why i completely forgot about it um with like actual pair of jeans as like a bodysuit and i think it looked very cool so we should now go back to the haul sorry i forgot this item but i still had to show it to you guys because i think this could be one of my faves actually no no i like all of it whoops this is another beauty that i haven't actually tried on yet so i have no clue what to expect and no i am not holding up a picnic blanket i promise so this is at the top of course it's a cohort because i mean what else would misha pick so it's just a little stretchy little cohort crop top off the shoulder and then these are the pantaloons now am i gonna look like i got lost and I got a bit cold, so I decided to wear my picnic blanket, or is this gonna look really cute? It's just like these palazzo trousers with a little tie around the waist. I'm hoping this looks adorable because I feel like it has loads of potential, but I just don't know. Um, it's a really nice lightweight fabric, so I feel like you could wear this in, say, like, American summer weather or, like, tropical summer weather, and you'd be good because, I mean, <laughs> English summer weather isn't a thing, as we all know. But, yeah, I hope these look adorable because, in my mind, I look like the best-looking picnic blanket you've ever laid your eyes on. Let's see. Hell yes to the picnic blanket. O M to the G. This is adorable like these trousers are so comfy they're like a three-quarter length this makes me look really long <laughs> but no oh my gosh i love this this is so cute let me come closer so you guys can see oh, just look at it oh my gosh i'm gonna live in this this summer because it's like oh yes it can be boiling but i could still wear my little jazzy picnic blanket yes Again, there's no picnic blanket song. Sad times. Maybe I should actually go for a picnic one of these days. I don't think I've ever had a picnic. Maybe when I was little did I go for a picnic. Mum, did you ever take me on a picnic? Because I'm pretty sure growing up I've never been on a picnic. No lovely guys whisked me away on a romantic picnic. How sad. This gets a 10 out of 10 from me. Whoop de whoop. We've got some more gingham. Yes, I'm loving on gingham. And these are high-waisted, hot pink gingham pants. What is not to love? Now, these are all the Actually Fashion Nova brand. I've never actually, I don't think, picked anything that's Actually Fashion Nova brand. Because a lot of the other items are from other, like, distrib distrib distributors that Fashion Nova sell. But these were $29, which is pretty darn good for high-waisted trousers, because what's that in, like, pounds? Like, 20 pounds, maybe? Close enough. But no, these are so nice. They're quite like a nice light fabric, so again, you won't go sweltering. And I mean, they're just very nice quality. I love a good stretch to a pant. And they're hot pink. What more could you want? Imagine it's like a really nice little white crop top. And it kind of goes with this. Oh, it's not quite the right shade for this lipstick. But, you know, you can forgive me, can't you? Cannot wait to look like a full-sized Barbie in these. Woohoo. Clueless pants come through. Okay, these are lush. Look at the shape. How nicely fitted they are. They don't give me a camel toe which is like brownie points to Fashion Nova. And just like, I feel like actually, again, Fashion Nova's looking after my booty. What am I doing? Okay, but no, these are so luscious. They're a really nice length. I could probably wear them with like a slight heel, like a heeled boot, but not like a 10 inch stiletto, which is brilliant. And I may even shorten them and then just wear them with like trainers. Cause I feel like it'd be quite nice to like dress down a dressy pant because you could wear these cash or put together depending on what you wanted to do now these are honestly again another piece that is such good quality it blows 
my mind like oh and these are also fashion nova brand and these are again at 29 dollars but look at the world's most adorable shorts just look at them they're like this mustard color is that like a mustard i'd say that's a mustard question is is it a dijon mustard or a i don't know another type of mustard i'll just go with dijon <laughs> And it's kind of like a paper bag waist. It's got a little bit of ruffling up top, but not loads. And then you can snatch in that waist with the belt. I mean, that's obviously an extreme version, but it's also got like these pockets. They're quite army style. And I've been seeing a lot of these shorts around and I just really like them. They're sound of walking away is the name of the item. Okay. Sound of walking away, you do you. But no, just look how nice quality these are. They're really nice on the bum as well. You'll see in the try-on clip because I have actually tried these bad boys on because I just couldn't wait. And I love them. Love them, love them, love them. I want them in every shade, but I'm pretty sure they only do them in one other shade. So I might have to get my hands on that. Yes. Also, you could pair it with a different belt. This belt is detachable. Like, you can... Meh, 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 meh. You can shimmy out. Oh, you could even use the belt for other things then. Oh, that's actually a really good shout. Well done, Misha. Well done. No, loving on these shorts. I think they'll go with everything for summer. And again, they're quite lightweight. So no sweaty crotch. Booyah. Here we have the mustard shorts. Now, can we see that they're like a smart short? So like, I would wear these to a business meeting. Not that I evidently go on many business meetings, but I just think they're like a put together pair of shorts. They're not too ripped, they're not denim, they're classy, they're smart, they're in a mustard shade, they don't show your bum, they do kind of go up your bum crack. Can I say that? They go up your bum crack quite a bit, but I just think they look really like army girl, cool, almost like Cheryl Cole, fight for this love sort of vibe. I seem to always go for that vibe, but oh, also this little white top is from Fashion Nova, and yeah, I just think this is actually a really cute outfit, and I cannot wait to wear this. I seem to have picked up loads of trousers in this haul, but I mean... Oh, well, like bottoms because I do have a lot of tops and not so many bottoms. So these are so cool. Yes, they are like a minty green. I have not tried these on. They're a size small and they're American Bazzy. Never heard of them, but hi American Bazzy if you're watching this, which I'm sure you're not. Oh, let me see what colour the button is. Right. I give up. So these are like that cargo pant, but they're such a good quality. Like, I don't know what it is about this selection of Fashion Nova clothes, but I've just picked everything that feels so damn expensive. Like, honestly, you would see these in some like American boutique for like flipping 80 quid or something, or $80, sorry, get my right lingo. And they're just, like they've got the, the rouging around the ankle, they've got a white strip. They're very little mix, that's what I think of them. And they've got this really jazzy belt that I can't wait to steal and wear with other clothes. But no, these are jazzy. I've no clue what they're gonna look like on. Let's hope I don't look like a couch potato because I am notorious for not really pulling off these sort of trousers, but a girl can try, so yeah, let's see. Okay, am I the only one that never knows how to do this damn Oh, hello vehicle. There always seems to be vehicles whenever I'm filming. I know I put my camera right by a window, so it's kind of my fault, but okay, does that look about right? But these trousers are the dark horse. I said it, there's another one, no surprise. I don't know what all these motions are. I seem to think I'm a dancer, I'm really not. But no, these are, and how nice do they look just with like a plain white top? I think these sort of cargo style pants are so flattering on so many body types. And I just love this colour. I feel like they're a unique cargo pant. Oh yes, love these. I feel like they probably make my bum actually look okay because they always kind of like make it look a bit bigger, which I don't mind. So what is that with Asda when they're like, save a lift? No, I can't remember the saying, but it's like, I'm not just hitting my bum on camera, I promise I'm actually doing the Asda theme tune. Last clothing item. Yes, I am going to a rave apparently, even though I'm really not. Oh my gosh, this actually looks mental on the camera, look at it. It looks like an optical illusion or something. I promise it's not. So, oh, oh, I've got them all 
confused but this is the crop top because yes it's another cohort i'm actually surprised this video doesn't have anything lilac in it because it's got a lot of cohorts so this is the little bandu bralette top a nice bit of elastic to keep the puppies at bay and then this is where like all the drama is happening look at these pants they're in that sort of style that i really like but they're quite wide and just i mean I mean, look at them. I know it kind of looks like really crazy 80s or 70s or 60s. I never know. I never know. But I think they're so cool. And then they've got a little belt so you can cinch it in. I just think this is a vibe. I need to go to a festival, but I really don't. I'll just shoot pictures in it for Instagram and pretend that I've gone to some wild exotic place the joys of instagram speaking of instagram you should follow me i don't know why i'm doing this i swear it's rude to point apologies friday night send the lights are low oh my gosh i'm so tone deaf but we're looking out for a place to go get a little rock music i don't know the words but ba -da -ba -ba I feel literally like i'm from abba in this outfit like this is the epitome of an abba outfit and I'm digging it. I feel like this pattern is very flattering because like, there's so many things going on, you don't really know where to look. So if you're trying to cover anything, I feel like this would be good. But here's a little look, the little crop toppy. It'd probably stay up a little bit better if I had something to put in it, but that's not the crop top spot. That's my own. And then here's the little tie. How does my butt look? That's the question. Does it look like loads of rectangles? because there was a lot of lines going on. But, oh my gosh, no, I love this. Okay, this is so cool. And obviously, if you don't want to make it so OTT, you could wear these trousers with different bottoms. Oh yeah, they're full, they're full length, I promise. Yes. Okay, tittle pit, next item time. Okay, yes. So follow me on Instagram at Misha underscore Grimes to see all of these pieces styled up on the gram. Yes, you can see them in all their glory. Oh, but I also actually have a pair of shoesies that I got from Fashion Nova. Now, there is actually such a storyline with these shoes and it's quite like an emotional story. So sit down, grab a tissue and let's all feel very sorry for Misha. So look at these shoes look at the beauty of these shoes they're like a dressy slide we all know i'm obsessed with slides so a dressy slide in yellow with diamonds is my idea of heaven well what's not my idea of heaven is when misha orders them in a u.s size six rather than a uk so they are actually like a uk four I can fit my big fat foot in it, but could I go out in them? Probably not. It's the most emotional story I think I've ever heard. But yeah, I'm just gonna show you guys how my foot's just too huge for them. Oh, oh sorry, sorry. I'm just, I'm, 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 I'm quite sad about this. So, just, can we see? Can we see? Yeah, so Misha, you're a complete idiot, but Anya is best pleased because Anya, my older sister, who actually has smaller feet than me, loves them and is going to steal them from me. So yeah, learn from my mistakes. Don't order a, UK, a US 6 thinking it's a UK 6. I'm actually a US 8. Yes, just a point of reference. If you're a UK 6, you're a US 8. If you want to order those shoes, Order them in a US 8 if you're a UK 6. Okay, that is enough. So, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Do not forget my discount code XO Misha G to save 20% off site wide. Honestly, I would not recommend Fashion Nova if I had any queries about it, but I hand on heart love all their pieces that I have chosen so far, and I do not have a bad word to say about them. They are so prompt. Honestly, 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 if you are scared or you're thinking about ordering or anything, go do it. Your life will be changed. Well, your fashion life will be changed. So yes, I'm going to wrap up this video. I hope you've enjoyed this super cool Sunday. Oh yes, it's most certainly my favourite video of the week and I hope your guys is too. So I'm going to love you and leave you. Make sure this video like, subscribe to my channel. 
What else is there to do? Um, click the bell or for post notifications because I know YouTube is doing some weird malarkey where they're putting subscriptions in like the order they think people want to see them rather than time order. So if you don't want to miss out and see my face, then you should not only subscribe, but you should click the bell. Yes, we're doing a bit of yoga. Well, that's not yoga, is it? That's more like stretching. Um, okay, so toodle pip, love you guys lots. I will see you all next time. Hopefully, if you subscribe, yes, you should. Bye, love you.